even serious people now, so-called opinion formers, bloated renter quotas, roped in radio forers, retired editors, life peers, no longer need to fight for their careers, money in their bank but scant fuel in their think tank, still influence us with their effluence grease, sending in copy from some club, bar or beach, slapdash and sloppy, call atheism a brand of religion, as a naturalist might call a heron an A pigeon. Does an Arsenal supporter call himself an A Tottenham fan? Should a woman be defined simply as not a man? Facile thinking from our so-called betters, loose thinkers now, cerebral bedwetters. I once thought danger lay in fiery words that stirred fanatics to reckless acts. But true peril lies where the influential are indolent, lazy with the facts. If I switch the off button on my TV, which channel am I viewing? If I say I'm not playing chess, does that tell you what I'm doing? And still bishops legislate in the House of Lords, while chaplains stalk our hospital wards assuming a right to be there and everywhere amplified in our public square.